This is Hindi Zaha for Eastsides. Don't forget about me. I don't understand. I don't understand. Okay, I, 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 je, I go back. Okay. Uh, hi, this is Hindi Zaha for Eastsides. Don't forget about me when you sleep And don't forget about me when you leave Cause day after day this love grows In so many ways this love knows How my heart is dying, trying, fighting all this passion me and my tears are falling drop and can start this is what we call love love so don't forget about me no don't forget about me It's a song uh, that I wrote um, just while I was recording the album mm -hmm. and uh, it came very naturally and it's uh, a love song that I, um, I started to do uh, on stage also. Uh, so it's, it's, a, it's a dedicate to also the, the the, the the jazz of the forties, fifties uh, kind of yes, an old jazz feeling. You there's something very old fashioned about your voice. I'm sure you, you get this a lot or no. Uh, you have to, right? A little. A little. Just a little yeah, bit? yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't yes. know, and I mean that with the utmost compliment. Like it's just there's something very almost timeless about your. For me, it's yeah. it's it's a big compliment because uh, my reference for for the voices that I, I really um, fall in love with is is the voices of uh, La Calas, uh, Edith Piaf, mm -hmm. uh, Ella Fitzgerald, Yima Sumac. So I'm really into these voices because I found it very. Um, the interpretation is very um, pa passion mm -hmm. passionate. Pa passionate, yeah. Yes, yeah. and and um, yes, I, I'm really um, really love that uh, it, the way to bring the the emotion through music with the voice. Have you? I mean, have you been playing music for a long time? I mean, yes. it just came to you. Like, were you like were your family, your parents? Were they musical? They, yes, my yeah. mother was a singer. She okay. was also um, playing uh, theater. Mm -hmm. 
but also we were living like um, you know gypsies because we were moving uh, uh, from town to town in Morocco and also because we were like 15 at home because there was the uncles the cousins the grandfather grandmother so I, I grew up with my uncles they were musicians singers uh, my grandfather was a dancer so it was um, um, music every day at home and also a lot of improvisation so I've learned to improvise and to do music with my family first mm -hmm. and they obviously they encouraged you because they're musical right? it's not like they're like no stop playing music right away <laughs> for my father it was quite dangerous because uh, he said it's a dangerous life you, you don't have security you have nothing to you know uh, it's it's an adventure, mm -hmm. and um, but I was really obsessed by music. And when I, I went to France, it was also still there. Music was in my mind, in my heart, and and so I started to take the dangerous uh, way. Yeah. <laughs> Did you ever consider, like, you know what, I'm just going to go into, I don't know, math? <laughs> I don't know, was there ever an idea, like, that you thought about it? Oh, um, I, I, I thought it was not, in fact, it's, it's not dangerous to, uh, to do what you like. I mean, for me, if I, I didn't choose the, the, this, this, this way of life, I would be crazy, mm -hmm. really crazy. Mm -hmm. So I prefer to be crazy in a good way. <laughs> yeah, that's <laughs> good. <laughs> so, um, I mean, you're in the States now. Are you touring? Um, are you touring like North America and yes, we start slowly for the album, right, as it comes out? Yeah, we start uh, at Los Angeles the 30th of September. Okay. Uh, and we finished the tour in New York the 22 of October. Great. Mm -hmm. Are you excited? Is this your first time touring uh, yes. the States? Okay. Yes. Very excited? excited. It's very, very excited. Yeah? Scared? Yes. A little? A little bit, <laughs> yeah. yes. Yes. Okay. But, you know, uh, since the album came out in Europe, you know, when, when I have to go, the more it's far, the more I'm happy. Because for me, to come from Morocco, to bring my music to Europe, and then to Japan, to mm -hmm. America, this is very, it's, you know, it's a long way. It's crazy in a good way. Right? Yes, <laughs> in a good way, yes, that's true. Now, do you have, like, years, I know this is your first album, right? Mm -hmm. um, do you have, like, years and years of material, that, like, as you were, you know... No, because I decided to choose the best of what I did for the first album. The things that I'm proud of and that I, I, I really like. Mm -hmm. And so I, I threw all the other songs away. Mm -hmm. And and for the the one that I love, that are not on the album, I played on stage. So um, I'm... I think I have to live for the moment, you know, and bring the good things for the moment. And all the things that I've did in the past, I have to, you know, to choose what is really close to me. Right. You could always come back to, you know, mm. some of the songs, right? I mean, yeah. change them around. No one's heard them, so you can <laughs> you can do whatever you want to them, right? Yes, but <laughs> I'm really, to, to, to be honest, I'm really concentrated on... Um, um, on, on the the new things, the the things that I've uh, exper experienced this last years uh, um, made me uh, s someone different. So I have to be with this, mm -hmm. uh, you know, uh, the diff uh, the the person, the new person I am. So I'm into the uh, the the new things, the new ideas, and also. Uh, to go back to the roots also, to Morocco, to play with musicians there. Mm. Hey,